this is problem 1.6 it says find the force and moment which must be applied at o to hold the light bar shown in equilibrium now this light bar o it is bolted at point o so when we draw the fbd we are going to have one reaction force in the x direction i'll call this rx one reaction force in the y direction i'll call this ry and there will be a moment in the z direction and call this mz now for equilibrium purpose it's a two dimensional body so what are the requirements the requirements are summation of forces in x and y direction should be equal to zero and the moment summation should be equal to zero so if you apply these equations in x y and z direction if i do x force balance the forces in x are this rx right here and 50 newtons so i can write rx plus 50 newtons equals to 0 now when i do y force balance the only force in the y direction is this ry so i can write ry has to be equals to 0 now then i look for z moment balance and if you see for moment balance we need a point about which we are going to take these moments so in this case we will choose point o because rx and ry both pass through that point that's why rx and ry will not give any moment now the third force that we have in this problem is your 50 newton force so about point o this 15 newton force is going to have this moment arm let's call this h and <clears throat> the value of h can be written as 0.3 meters times if this angle is 30 degrees right here it's going to be the sine component now about this point o if you notice mz is acting in the counter clockwise direction and this 50 newton force if you follow the arrow this is going to be in the clockwise direction about point o so now we can write down the equation so mz since it is counter clockwise i'll put a negative sign there and then the 50 newton force the force value and the moment arm which is 0.3 meters sin 30 degrees so if i solve these equations i can directly find out from the first equation which is this one rx value is minus 50 newtons ry value comes from your second equation and this is equals to 0 and mz value from the third equation can be calculated as 7.5 newton meter and this is the final answer to this problem